This coming Tuesday, August 28th, Once in My Lifetime, opens at the Shays Smith Theater in downtown Buffalo. And Daybreak's Joshua Robinson visited the cast and the crew to see how they're making that dream a reality. Eight friends walk into a bar to watch the Bills win their first Super Bowl. No, it's not a joke. It's not a dream. It's a reality, at least on the stage of the Shays Smith Theater. When I first heard of the show, I just, I just knew that somehow the Bills won the Super Bowl. How would your life be different if the Bills were champions? It's an idea the play's producer Chris Braun loved tossing around after seeing a friend create a similar play based on the New Orleans Saints. He called it Ain't That Super. And then when he did it, I was like, wow, this would really work in Buffalo. I'd love to do it. I said, I'm doing this one way or another. I'm going to do this. So Braun emailed award-winning playwright Donna Hoke, based right out of Buffalo, and pitched the idea for his play, Once in My Lifetime, a Buffalo football fantasy. And she was like, hey, that sounds good. I'm free right now. Let's do it. I'm like, are you kidding me? We talked on the phone. It might have even been like within hours that we were on the phone together kind of talking about it. And then I think when it was actually happening, he thought, I don't even know you, <laughs> which was so it was a huge leap of faith for him to commission this play. And so the Miracle Bar was born, where eight tortured Bills fans go every Sunday to cheer and lament their team. The bar looks a little beat up. That's intentional. It's not supposed to be a brand new sports bar, but kind of had this bar open for 18 years waiting for the Bills to win, and it looks like it. And maybe the hardest job falls on those eight actors. There's a lot of stuff that we have to relive because we talk about it, and my character particularly is very bitter about the, uh, the Music City miracle forward lateral. Actors like John May, who also works for Two on Your Side, says it's a gift and a curse to be able to remember exactly where he was for so many of those famous and infamous moments. I still to this day remember very, very clearly that moment of that kick, and oh yeah, however many years ago it was. And all of that just comes back to you naturally. And we don't have to act when we get to that point, because I know exactly how that felt. Now, May wouldn't spoil any other details for me about how the miracle takes place, but the one thing he did spoil, this play is not about the Bills. It's about Western New Yorkers, the people who dream every year of that miraculous Sunday afternoon and who never, ever give up <laughs> until it does come true. Quick fun fact, that story ain't that super that was put on by the Saints. After that play came out, the Saints won their first Super Bowl. So who knows, maybe we'll have some good luck here in Buffalo. But regardless of whether it works for the Super Bowl, you've got a chance to earn a discount on one of these tickets if you want to see it. You can find that code online at WGRZ.com. From the Theater District, I'm Joshua Robinson.